Hi, welcome to According to Lou. I am Lou. And I was reading something, not reading, I was watching something and it came up in conversation with these two people about the difference between self-confidence and self-esteem. Self-confidence is an act. The choices we do, what we do. Self-esteem is a sense of being. So like we're born with this very, very high self-esteem. Of course, situations can change, like anybody can get knocked down if their home life is bad or, you know, stuff like that. But we're naturally born with this high self-esteem because we just do. I mean, what kid do you see running around that says, oh, I'm nothing. I am nothing. My person does not matter here. It's very rare that you see any young person feeling that way about themselves. So we naturally have this high self-esteem and then self-confidence is the act, the choices we make, what we do. But we need to not associate what we do with who we are. And I think that's a lot of people, even myself, will say, I did this, I'm a bad person. But that's not true. I'm not a bad person for what I've done, unless I've killed somebody or, you know, like went up and beat somebody up. Then I just might be a bad person. So that just contradicted everything I just said. But I don't go around beating people up. So I wanted to share that with you, that self-esteem and self-confidence are not the same thing and that we should, when we have a negative thought, we should be able to determine in our minds, like, that doesn't make me who I am. Because there are choices to be made. That is... We need to build our self-confidence up. And when we build our self-confidence up, like, okay, I wear hoodies a lot. In a lot, mo e like, every single day, I am wearing a hoodie. I don't care if it's summer or what. When I'm not wearing a hoodie, and this is just me, and it's very trivial, and it's stupid, but I'm not as confident with myself. Because I do have body dysmorphic disorder, and I've talked about that in another video, like, when I wear a hoodie, I can, I can rule the world. Without that, I'm not. So I associate my self-esteem, I've associated with my confidence when I wear a hoodie. Take the hoodie off. This is something I need to learn, is that if I'm wearing anything other, there are times I wear a t-shirt. It's usually a comfortable t-shirt. And this is stupid. It's just one example where I associate my self-confidence with my self-esteem. I'm confident when I'm wearing this shirt. And my self-esteem has gone up when I wear this shirt. But why can't I wear a t-shirt and be have that same high self-esteem? So I associate my confidence with my self-esteem. I hope, I hope I completely and utterly confused you because I just confused myself. I need to do my research and we will remake this whole thing. You're welcome. I'm just trying to help. <laughs> and then I confuse myself. <laughs> anyway. Only according to Lou.